Hello everybody, how's it going? It's Eamon here. I uh, hope you're all keeping well out there. Um, I'm just back today with some tutorial advice for people who are having trouble in OMSI 2. Um, I said I would do this tutorial for the editing and AI, editing an AI list in, um, in the game. I've done that one previously, so people have been asking me how to change buses in a map. So today I'm going to show you the simple quick and easy way to do this and it literally takes no more than three minutes max depending on the map so first of all what you want to do is navigate to the map that you want in your steam directory for today's example we're just going to use the south london project because there's a hype over it and we're just going to use the beta for it today and um, that drives the enviro 400s Be i chose this one because it um it's I have it set up with running the Volvo B90L single door in Dublin color so I said I would revert it back to the Enviro 400 or the London Enviros or the London B90Ls dual doors um, so I'm not sure what I want to do maybe I will do the, the Enviro because the dual doors is pretty simple you know uh, you don't really need to do much really so we're just going to jump straight into it um, you open up your AI list in your maps, your London maps folder. So you go to OMSI, uh, your program files, Steam, Steam maps, common, OMSI 2, and then maps. So this would be the list of maps. As you can see, I have a lot of maps. Uh, <laughs> so um, you navigate down to the South London map, then you click on your AI list. So you have your AI list open. Um, you don't really need to go near anything here because um, I have a few things edited in mine but um, they're just cars that drive around the map I presume the more you enter here the more um, the more variety you get in the map I'm not 100% sure so uh, so I don't know um, but what we're looking down we want to go down to the AI group depot uh, which is here and as you can see there's a few of them so we're gonna kind of run through this really kind of hopefully quickly um depending on the bus you want so you have here uh vehicles so this here is your the vehicle that you're using in this uh ai group depot uh so you have your type group 2 volvo b90l gemini 2 forward slash b90l dot bus so basically what this is is a part to your bus so vehicles is the folder it's in the other folder then is the volvo b90l gemini 2 so if you just navigate out to uh, your vehicles folder so again so this is the part that you're kind of looking at vehicles and then you're going down to uh, the, the bus that you want so the Volvo B90L Gemini 2 so that's your second folder so basically the, the first three the first two are folders you know so vehicles and B90L and then forward slash B90L dot bus so the dot bus file is the, the model bus file so that you use so when you're in your your vehicles folder so again we have the Volvo B90L Gemini 2 click in and you have the dot bus here so you have so that's the bus that I use in my map you know it's pretty simple really um, so what we're going to do today is we're going to change it around and we're going to change it to the Dennis Enviro 500 or 400 sorry um, in I don't know what colors I have it in so I'm just gonna f go up to Dennis Enviro 400 oh here it's the I presume you all have the Dennis Enviro 400 London so so what you're gonna do here is what I usually do is when I'm in my AI list so you have vehicles Volvo Gemini 2 so what I usually do is just kind of go in and out so you go vehicles you have your folder here so you go down to rename you copy that Volvo Enviro 400 London you bring it in here you kind of highlight the folder of the previous bus and you paste in and then you have Dennis Enviro 400 London then you need to go in back again so it's kind of back and forward oh sorry I'm just uploading the video uh, if you kind of have to go back and forward a little bit so then you have the London Enviro 400 mod dot bus so again you just right click rename and you kind of take the whole thing you highlight it see dot bus mod uh, you go into your AI list and you remove the B90L and you just kind of V Enviro 400 London bus dot bus so 
what that does then is that will pick that bus for you but it won't do it unless you kind of edit these bits down here but what I'm just going to do for now if you want the same bus in the map for each AI group you just copy that like so you go copy then you go down and then you put it everywhere you see the previous bus underneath the, the vehicle groups so you go control and V again down here control and V again down here anyway you see the the bus uh, control and V and then and so on so but I'm gonna leave the uh, the Volvo B90 out no I better not just in case actually you just, you just can't see it so I'll just do it so so you can put any bus in here you know any bus you want now so what I've done there is I've kind of put the the London bus in all these AI groups but they won't work because we have registration numbers here of the the Gemini so what you want to do is if you have Microsoft Excel you can open that up I find it easier to open that up you just kind of copy all these just from this AI list uh, this AI group you copy control and C you're just gonna throw them into Excel like that right so they're all your registration numbers for the DM the Volvo B9TL it's a bit confusing so step by I, I'll kind of repeat myself a lot as the video goes on so you go back in here and um, you go to your London regs then so you need your reg plates for the London buses which is not that many of them um, mm -hmm. there's not that many of them so we'll just take these ones now you know what you can do actually I'm just gonna try this out actually as a test so I'm just gonna go back into Excel and I'm just going to say do 2567 right 2568 I'm just gonna go like that and kind of go down drag it down and overwrite these ones here so you kind of just kind of fill the series right, so I'm just going to copy these and I'm just going to paste these numbers in no I won't actually do that yet no well, so I'll just leave them there actually so see what what happens here is you see if I'm right then what will happen is I'll all these 50 odd numbers here will generate um, I'll copy these like as I said and I will just put them in here the Enviro 400 reg file that way we have these numbers in the reg file Six eight two two five. yeah so basically then red that it doesn't really matter what um what numbers you can put in the reg file as long as there's numbers in it will that reference the bus that you're picking so um i know i'm going to kind of i'm getting a bit confusing here but um you don't have to do any of that if you're not picking this bus you know so but it, you can do it if you need to be if you need to do it so but at the end i will kind of i will go over in a quick the quick kind of overview of it again just kind of see so now what you want to do is you want to get the repaint so you have to go into your Enviro 400 texture folder which again is in your Enviro 400 London folder you click it you click repaints and you can pick uh, Arriva London CTI here you know so you just again like in my other video you just kind of click on uh, highlight London click control and C to copy it and then you just can go out there and um, you go back into Excel and you paste that over Dublin and then you just kind of kind of double click down if you're familiar, familiar with Excel you know you know so then what you do is you kind of grab these two and you kind of control and C and um, go into your AI list you remove all these ones or highlight them all all these ones and that has a Dublin beside it in the force AI group control and V and then you, every time you kind of put in a new thing you have to just press backspace because this end has to be underneath the last registration number you know it always has to be like that you know so then so that's basically that one done so then we can go on to the next one again you take these 
and then you control and see them you bring them into Excel you control and V them you can copy the London one from here because it's the same kind of place it came from you just go down here now if there's only a small few numbers you know like what one like uh, these these few here you can go just take an original um, registration number you know from here and just basically menus there A. so you just kind of you can take eight of these A. control and C just control and V and then just kind of give a bit of a there should be a bit of a gap in them when so again you just control and C it's a lot of it is control and pasting you know control and V so there we go and again you just have up here you just have to go end you know just so it closes off the AI group so we go we continue going just to kind of show you how it's done control and C then again control and V control and C control and V London Um, go back into your AI list how many have we here now four five six seven so seven so you want to take the next seven that's seven there isn't it I'm sure if it's not be one more control and C control and V and then again you highlight these ones control and C it's 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 an endless act like you know like you can kind of go on and on depending on the AI list you have like if you check the Berlin AI list it's massive and I wouldn't go near it so again control and C the next one back in here control and V control and C control and V London so one two three four five six seven seventeen okay so we have to take seventeen of these Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, seventeen. Control and C. Control and V. Control and C. <laughs> see what I mean? Control and V. When you get the hang of it, like, and you kind of get into it, it kind of works a lot better, you know. I'm just going to um start up OMSI here for the moment, just to kind of have it ready for when um when we want to check out the the repaints I did control and see them already didn't I and uh, what's the name of this hashtag 5 u yeah I did yeah so did I control and no so you just take this one's control and C actually you know what I'll have to stop the game because I made it in an AI list stupid aiming control and V control and C Control and V and down and then you kind of go back into your registration thing. How many am I taking? Thirteen. Three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I will see. If you kind of see that you grab more, you can just kind of check it out. And as you see, I have grabbed more. You can just put it beside and just kind of delete them and then kind of copy them again and then just throw them in there again then just go copy paste and and now we're on the last one so we just take these ones see these ones have smaller registration numbers than the last ones because I think I added them ones in myself as far as I'm aware um, I think I did anyway, so you just go control and C again. You just take London, you just paste it in over. Oh, hang on, C, V. We have eight, so we just take eight more of these six, seven, eight. We probably would have had enough actually for the um. For the uh, the London, uh, oh, without creating our own registration numbers, you probably would have had enough to kind of to do us, but sure we'll see anyway. And V, 
Okay, so we're gonna wait it over there. Tap that over there anyway. And then you just click end. Now you save and close out of it. I'm just gonna close OMC again and then I'm gonna open it again to see if this worked. This should work, you know. If it doesn't work, I'll be surprised, but um it should do. Because I've done everything right and you know I'm just thinking now I didn't actually um I didn't save it. So if it doesn't work then I'm screwed basically. But sure the new London is coming out soon enough so so hopefully now we'll have <coughs> Dennis Enviro 400s flown around the map and they're driving in London repaints. That's the plan anyway boys. London city, London city. London, London, London. The shoot London project. So we want this bus on the map. Load map without buses. I'll go somewhere, I'll go Crystal Palace because it doesn't load up that much stuff, so. Uh, Crystal Palace bus station. Now we'll let it do its business there. We're in process me video. So yeah, so hopefully now this will work and um, I help just um, basically get it, get it done. I'll leave it on because I'd rather I'd like this load quicker probably. My next video will probably be of Elham, the Route 23, I think, um, during the day. I might have no buses here at all. We could be screwed. Ah, oh, there we go. That's how we do it, boys. That is how it's done. We have Enviro 400s driving around the map with the London repaints. So if you have a look here, it's this way I always say, when you have this menu open, if you just click here, you can see that it has the, the registration number that I put in. Um, then it has the newer registration numbers, you know. So any number you can put into the registration file is fine. Now I don't know whether it's single or double digits, I'm not sure, but I always kind of just throw in four numbers just to be on the safe side, because a lot of registration numbers have four. So is that the one here, is it? Is that the one that I created? Yeah, see, that's the registration number there. So you could really put in anything, I guess, you know, and it will work fine. So it would. So yeah, so that's how you um you create uh, and put new buses on a map. It's pretty simple. So it is. Um, so yeah, so that's all she wrote, really. Yeah, um, yeah so I'll just close out my OMSI. And I'll just go over it one more time really quick. Um, just in the AI list itself. Just click out of reg. Uh, do you want to save? Yeah. So when you're in your AI list of your South London map, as I said, you have to go to your vehicles folder, then your vehicle of your folder, your vehicle of the bus you want, and then the the, f the dot bus basically model, you know. You put that in here, then these numbers here are in your registration file of your bus. Um, you can add them yourself or you can use existing ones but sometimes they don't have enough numbers for the AI list you want to edit then over here then you have your repaint number and base or your repaint name base you have to go into the texture file itself the CTI file and copy this this the London you can't just type in London because it won't generate anything so you need to kind of look at it and see that it's um, from the actual CTI file of the repaint that you need you know and the CTI file is the file in the texture um, of the vehicle. Uh, Dennis. Dennis Enviro 400 mod in the texture file. So it's usually in a texture, then a repaint folder, or I could call Wernberg, it's all the one, it's all German. And then it's just the CTI file that has all your kind of repainted stuff in it. We could have done a different thing, you know, but we didn't. You know, I didn't actually go down and see all these, which is a shame. You know, but anyway, um, so yeah, so it has to generate from there, and then from there onwards, then you just kind of do the same thing. You know, your registration numbers, existence, or whatever. You could easily, you could put a new bus in here as well if you wanted, like you know, with B90L London or B90L Dual Door. It's up to yourselves. 
but remember you have to have the reg file and a repaint of that bus in that folder uh, texture folder so yeah so guys um that's how it's done hopefully this helps you and uh if it didn't and something's still going wrong just drop a comment in the comment box and i'll see if i can help you in any way and um yeah so you asked for it i gave it to you so i shall talk to you again soon boys adios naragia